Right next to Seattle's iconic Space Needle is the Chihuly Garden and Glass Museum. Here in Seattle, the art of glass blowing got its start in America. In the museum's garden, colorful glass sculpture burst out from the ground among plants, flowers, and trees. The Exhibition Hall Gallery showcased some of the most significant works by Dale Chihuly, a native of Washington State. The glass house is a centerpiece, focusing on Chihuly's lifelong appreciation of greenhouses. And up above, you are looking at one of the largest suspended sculptures he's ever created. So there are over a thousand Persians, that's what he calls the sculptures that you're looking at, suspended above our head in hues of orange and reds and yellows. There's the Glass Forest Gallery, where visitors are blown away by a display of colors and lights. The Sea Life Room shows how the Pacific Ocean inspired Chihuly. Its 20-feet-tall sculpture is a washed sea life. A car accident in the 1970s cost him his vision in one eye, but he continued to create works full of complex colors, details, and size. I had no idea what I was going to see when I came in here, but they've incorporated so many beautiful colors and styles of design. We have pictures of Chihuly glass in gardens in our home. Uh, but they really don't do it justice. You really have to see it live and in person. And to see everything's just a little bit different is so impressive. You wonder how he did this. I mean, it's, it's just overwhelming almost. Exhibitions worldwide shows Chihuly's art, but this museum serves as the only permanent home for his works. Valdia Baraputri, VOA News, Seattle.